What's up, YTPC? I'm gonna shoot this a little out of order. Um, so I got a trade from Cherry on Top a couple weeks ago. And uh, I have a video and I haven't put that out yet. It's a little bit longer. This one's gonna be pretty short. Uh, <clears throat> smoking my Morgan Bones. Rhodesian stubby Rhodesian. I th it's 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 called a stubby bulldog. I talk about this in my other video, but it's got a short round shank, so Rhodesian. Uh, Mish Carey, she's out of frame. I don't know if you want to come in, show them what you got. She's smoking, which by the way doesn't happen a lot. She used to take a puff or two, but she's got a small bowl going. Oh. Ratchet is Black Virginia, so we'll talk about that real quick. Impromptu. Um, what should we call it? I can't even talk. It's Friday. It's okay. Uh, review. I sip it on Coors Light. Either like it or you don't. I love Coors Light. But let me see. So this one, her church, her church warden. So it is, it is a, I guess it'd be more of like a novelty pipe, but it smokes, and I, I know she doesn't smoke a lot, like at all really, so I got her a one. Good draw, it's, it's nice and cool, but the, the Rattray is Virginia, you can see ribbon cut out the tin it smells like Christmas it smells like sugar plums it's so good really dark sweet stewed almost mm -hmm. not really easy to clench if you can imagine but if you need if you need a palate cleanser you need a nice break this is a good one. It's it's uh, Black Virginia. Yeah, so it's just Black Cavendish Virginia. You see there's a description on the tin on the bottom. Pure Black Cavendish processed from different Virginia tobaccos. So it's, yeah, 100 gram tin. I got this a while ago. It's one of my yabos back on Oahu. And uh, it's, it'd be good for blending, I would say. Um, but I've been smoking a lot of real heavy blends, a lot of Englishes, smoky, a lot of Kia, um, old dark fired kind of blends, and I kind of been snubbing this one, and uh, this carry one of the light, real kind of easy going smoke, so I got that going for her, and it's a real good break. It's like a nice, nice uh, little treat. <clears throat> it's. Uh, I thought it would be more fruity on the tongue, on the nose, it's very plum, raisin, but very smooth, sweet smoke. And I like it, it's a good, it's a good uh, palate cleanser. Okay, so the other part, the main part of the review, I don't know about main, but anyway, is one of the blends that uh, Cherry sent, we were going back and forth, I sent him some early morning pipe, not my favorite blend. Uh, but I've been getting more into Englishes and Balkans, so he sent me he sent me a good amount of options, and they're amazing. So this one I'm trying now is JLP's NASPC Dragonweed or Smogweed. Some of it's uh, labeled as Smogweed, and limited edition, Tolkien inspired. It's an English ribbon cut. It's got uh, Virginia. Cypress Latakia and uh, Orientals. So on the nose, on the nose, it's um, get that real nice smoky Latakia, right? And kind of a darker sweet from the Virginias. Excuse the wind; it's really windy today. 
it's got a nice earth woody kind of like a dark musty leather on the nose I think which I like and I was looking for something smoky on a smoky side for the cold weather today when I say cold I'm talking about what's today 83 I think I high know. of 83 Mm-hmm. Wait, I'm getting cold. I'm getting acclimated. Oh, it stays lit really well. I had it down there for a couple minutes. It's still going. Um, Retro Hill. Not the roundest, not the smoothest, but it's not super rough. Yet the smokiness isn't aggressive, but it is forward. And uh, I'll begin. Don't worry about the noise. Any help? Got a party fall happening. Just lost a still hard one. The smokiness, like I was saying, is up front. Not aggressive though, but it rounds with a nice sweet Virginia. So it's, uh, I think they're red Virginias. It's aged pretty well. Really smooth. Sometimes when you have an English blend, you get like a real kind of uh, tart or almost peppery to me on the palate for uh, some of the orientals, kind of like tangy. And this one's not too tangy. It's definitely not as tangy as uh, early morning pipe for my palate. Um, honestly, when thinking about it now, the Virginia finishing note is, good, is reminiscent of the Black Virginia, like a stoic Virginia. So it's nice and sweet, a calm, I can't remember how many reviewed it, but I think it got like a, it was almost mid-level. I think it was like a 2.1, and I think it's a lot higher than that. Uh, now, is it a Maltese Falcon or a Presbyterian mixture? Not quite. Uh, I think it holds its own, though. I think in that mixture, I would go Smogweed, Maltese Falcon, and then Presbyterian. Yeah, and that's what it's closest to. It reminds me of those those mixtures. And uh, yeah, so I got that from Cherry. Super stoked! I get to try it. If you if you come across it and you want to add some uh, uh, mild English, that's not incense heavy. Throw it in your rotation. That's a good one. I don't. I also don't I dedicate this. Pipe. I just been smoking this pipe a lot. I like it. So I've been smoking um, some Virginias in it. I've so even had some aromatics, but I kind of go through. So it might be sweetening the blend a little bit, but the, the smoke I'm really getting is, I don't feel like it's too um, interrupted on the white coast and stuff. So, that being said, I hope you guys have a good Friday. Thanks for stopping by, checking out this video. Also want to shout out to Palette and Piper. Uh, I was super stoked that I won the giveaway yesterday that you had. Uh, so I'm looking forward to trying, trying some uh, Penzance. I'm really excited about it. One of those blends you hear a lot about and it's very hard to keep stocked. So I'm stoked. I also got an order coming in. Excuse me, tobacco pipes. Kind of cellaring up. Got some cigars on the way, branching out a little bit. Anyway, uh, yeah, go enjoy your Friday, you guys. Quit sitting around watching me. Go drink some beer and some some good liquor and have a good blend. And uh, me, and Miss Carrie, gonna get some food. We got a concert down the road. We're gonna do a sound check. So major rage is going on. Yeah.
kind of cool stuff. I do wish it was a little less fit, but you can't complain. It beats the fucking sweltering heat that we had uh, a couple weeks ago. So I'm a happy camper. Alright, this is 907 Piper.